Carol, it could not have been a happier meeting and a happier ending for these two. Thanks to years of persistence, Douglas Wynn found his father here in Greenville, coming from New Mexico to spend Christmas with him for the first time ever. <laughs> Imagine um, I don't even know that I have, you know, a dad. I got a son I didn't know anything about. Once just a pipe dream. Are you finally? That wish finally came true. When I first heard, I'm your son. Just a few months ago, Bobby Irving couldn't believe what he was hearing. I kind of move on with my life, and uh, but I, it, it's still in my mind, just like I have to find him. Douglas Wynn was born and raised in Vietnam. Bobby was serving there in the military when he met Douglas's mother. After a year, Bobby was transferred. I never spoke with his mom after I left Vietnam, so I had no way of knowing. Never knowing she was pregnant. All I have is just his first name, Bob. Douglas, now living in New Mexico, never stopped searching. With the help of DNA tests, he found his father living here in Greenville. You know, I couldn't see believe my eyes. And so I first I say, let's go ahead and call. But I say, what am I gonna tell? And after getting a chance to talk with him, I said, I really do have a son. After phone calls and some planning, the two shared an emotional embrace here in Greenville. Just knowing that I did create another life. Hey, and I got the living proof right here. It's a great feeling. A lot of time to make up for now. I want to do the things father and son do. The two are just excited to get to know each other. You can have a lot of things in your life, but you only got one, one dad. After decades of wondering, and many roadblocks. Greatest <laughs> gift that you can ever give a person. Don't give up. And the the reward when you get it is brightless. And throughout this whole process, Douglas connected with some other cousins and family members through those DNA tests. He and his family are going to meet up with them while they're here in Greenville. After Christmas, he says Bobby will come back with them to New Mexico and stay with them for as long as he wants. Carolyn Gabby.